I'm going to show you how to program remote controls for your NICE 1050 board. And in this case, these are the uh, standard NICE remotes that already will communicate with your receiver that's built into the board. These aren't third-party re remotes. And this is a box of 10. They all come wrapped in these little individual boxes with instructions and everything. And it comes with a little strap uh, for the remote. Makes it a little easier to hold these because they're very tiny remotes. There you go. So to program it, what you're going to do is you're going to push this button on your 1050 board and hold it for three seconds or so until this light that's right above it will light up. Go ahead and zoom in there so you can see a little better. So I'm going to press and hold the button. Then I get the light on the top. And now I'm going to press and hold the button that I want to program. In this case, I'm going to program the bottom button. You see the LED flash? And then you'll get three flashes from the receiver. And then I can let go. And then it goes back to solid. Now I have 10 seconds if I want to do another one before it'll reset. Press and hold the button on another one. And I get the three flashes meaning that that's been accepted, goes back to solid. And then again, I can do another one. I got to do it within 10 seconds. The three flashes, and I can let go. And then you just repeat. And you can do as many remotes as you have um, to get programmed. And that's how you uh, program the receiver. So now what you'd want to do after this is done, if you wait about um, five or ten more seconds, you're going to see that light just went out. Um, and now these things are active, and you can go ahead and test them uh, on your gate and uh, see that they're working. All right. So, hey, that's um, how you program your standard NICE uh, remotes into your Apollo 1050 board. There are some other features that you can do with these remotes where you can learn the code from another remote that's already programmed. Um, and you can transfer that right to here without even being near the gate. Um, so that's another option for you. Um, I'll cover that in a separate video. Um, there's also other ways to take two remotes and uh, put them right next to each other um, and pass the signal um, by really just putting them right close to each other. There's a series of commands for that as well. So hey, I hope this was helpful for you to learn how to program your nice remotes into your 1050 board. And if it was, please give the video a thumbs up. That'll help other people find it as well. And as always, have a great day.